What is up, car family, Matt in Virginia? Passion for cars, coming at you with a weekly pickup video. And I've got a ton of stuff, so I apologize up front. This will probably be a little bit longer video. But I got a bunch of stuff that I got from, of course, from Tops Now, website, the Tops website as usual. Um, but I got a special edition this week because my father was in town. And we hit our local, my local car shop here, the 10th inning in Hampton, Virginia. Uh, and got some epic stuff uh, coming out of that card shop. So all that stuff is vintage. So stick around to the end to see all the vintage goodies. <clears throat> with that said, we'll pop right into it. <coughs> Starting with some tops now. Pools. J.A. Happ in the Yankees debut, former Philly. Eovaldi in his Red Sox debut. Zach Wheeler. Acuna hitting leadoff home runs in both games of a doubleheader. <coughs> Excuse me. Call up for Tuki Toussaint. Jacob DeGrom. Without the hair. Paul DeYoung with a walk-off homer. First of his career. Getting smashed on the back. That's a great action photo there. Rookie card of Ronald Guzman. Here's the back of that one. Rookie card of Daniel Palka. Walk-off homer. For the White Sox. Call up Cedric Mullins for the Orioles. Three hits in his Major League debut. I love getting these call up in rookie cards because you just never know where some of these guys might end up. Rookie card of Ryan McMahon for Colorado. Yeah, these Tops Now cards are super, super high quality. Great gloss. Cool holograms. Great pictures. Brian Holiday for the Marlins. Getting a golden shower. Can't be happy about that. There's a great, great action catch of Ronald Acuna. Sweet, sweet picture. He's like, yeah, I got it. Well, no big deal. Sean Newcomb. Flirting with a no-no. And these are cool. These are all the Hall of Fame inductees. So you start with Chipper Jones. You got the playing day picture on the back. A nice little memorial set for the Hall of Famers. Jim Tomey. Jack Morris. Alan Trammell. Vlad Guerrero. Trevor Hoffman. And the final tops now. Rookie card of David Boat or Bodie. Walk off Grand Slam. All right, that's it for the tops now pickups. Also picked up the 
National Baseball Card Day team set of the Phillies. We got Reese, O'Double, Kingery, Michael Franco, Aaron Nola, Jorge Alfaro. Carlos Santana, Jake Arietta, Cesar Hernandez, and JP Crawford. So that was the Phillies team set. Got the latest edition of the Throwback Thursday off the Tops website, and this again is a uh, nice set showing all the recent Hall of Famers. We got Chipper. All the backs will be the same. It's a 1960 Tops design. Jim Tomei. Jack Morris. Alan Trammell. Vladimir Guerrero and Trevor Hoffman. All right, so did one trade on Beckett this week. I traded some, uh, I think some Heritage or something, and picked up this 2016 Topps Chris Bryant. This is the camouflage edition. If you look at the Cubs on his jersey, there you can kind of see the camo. Um, so needed that for the master set, so I traded for that. Off the Tops Now site, I picked up some, uh, scratch and sniff, game used, or event used, home run derby socks of Reese Hoskins, number to 25. The socks were pretty cool, so... And of course, I'm a huge Phillies fan, so add that to the Thickey collection. It's got the bracket on the back of who beat who. So, thought that was a nice one. All right, and the rest is vintage. So, here we go to my vintage peeps. Of course, you know, I'm working on the 1966 top set. Mostly, what I need is high numbers. Uh, my LCS had a few that I picked up. Um, and he said they're going to be tough to find. So, first one I picked up was this Hal Woodishik. Got this Joel Horlin. These are all high, well, not all high numbers, but mostly high numbers. Dick Hauser, a little crease there at the top, but it'll do me for now. John Sullivan. Floyd Weaver, this is the only non-high number. And then this really nice rookie card of Denny McLean. Appears to be in pretty good condition. Didn't even know this existed, but it's a 1966 Topps rub off. Very, very off center, but that's okay. Of Mickey Mantle. So I'll add that to the Mickey Mantle collection, trying to catch all his Topps and Bowman's cards. So that's one I wasn't even aware of. So glad to pick that one up. And I picked up, he had this uh, reprint. The card is a reprint play ball card, but the autograph is legit of Hank Greenberg. He pretty much gave me that for nothing. So I thought that was pretty cool. I'm not really an autograph guy, but I couldn't pass up the deal. And then second to last, I picked up this 53 top satchel page. 
little scuffs there in the top right are on the case, not on the card. Corners obviously are soft, but still a pretty nice card. And then last but not least, also for the Mickey Mantle collection, I showed this in an earlier video, the Thicky card giveaway. If I didn't want to show you the card, but I'll do that now. 1955 Bowman Mickey Mantle. So the best of my knowledge, I think I need a couple of inserts from the regular top series. I need the 52 tops, and then I need the 51, 52, and the 253 Bowmans. And I think I'll have the mantle run, so very, very happy to get that 55 Bowman from the local card shop. All right, enjoy the pickups, everybody. Y'all have a great week, and stay classy.